Hi and greetings today, 74 of 101 days of winter. Last night was a shocking night's sleep. Um, I had really, really bad nightmares. Uh, they weren't about my ex or my nan, but they were pretty bad. Um, so yeah, I had a shocking night's sleep. Ended up sleeping until 12.30, the Savo. It was, you know, it was a bad night. It was just a bad, bad night. Um, so, yeah. Let's get to today's t-shirt. So, here's Statue Falls t-shirt. Mistaken for trophies. Good band, good shirt. Even though you can... It's a little weird of a shirt. Today's movie is Garden State. Um, Garden State is a very emotional memory for me. Uh, it's one of the movies I watched with one of my old girlfriends. Not the most recent one, but one of the ones that I really cared about. And her name is the same as the female character in the movie. And she has a lot of the same psychological issues that the woman named Sam in this movie had. So, me and her both had the thing with the movie. She really enjoyed it, I really enjoyed it. But yeah, it was a weird thing. Um, I thought Zach Braff did a very good job with this film. Um, had a few of those. She's kind of a manic pixie dream girl, kind of. At the same time, she's kind of not. <coughs> she's got her own fucked up problems. So, usually the Manic Pixie Dream Girl, Dream Girl is only there for to make the guy seem the error of her ways, but she's kind of fucked up and all that kind of shit as well. So, people call her as the call her that. So, I guess she might be that, but she has a little bit more to her than that. So. I really enjoyed this film. That's why it's on the list and this in the top 31. Um, haven't watched it in a while yet for... Um, just haven't... Haven't needed to go back to it. But, um... Yeah. I think if you haven't seen it, you should. So yeah, I don't have much else to talk about today. Um, I had a pretty good day yesterday with um, hanging with Ben, watching the games. <laughs> um, I have a um, basically due to my increased weight that I've put on over the last year or so. I've been getting more ingrown hairs around my thigh region, which is in because it kind of gets removed and then it kind of goes in. And basically now I've got this kind of I'm bleeding a lot, and it's basically this purple kind of cyst, abscess, I don't know what you can really call it, about that big on my inner thigh. And every time I walk, it, it basically, my other leg kind of touches it. Every time I sit down, it causes a fair bit of pain. So... 
that came to a head this morning, as in... <coughs> I've done a very bad thing and put another band-aid on it. But that's pretty much just to stop the bleeding. But of course it makes it even more tender and it's just a... This isn't the first time I've had one, but it's the first time I've had one where it's a chafing issue. Like I've had a couple on my thigh and it, but luckily enough it hasn't, there's no chafing there, so. That's what I'm going through at the moment. Thought I would share. Ugh. Um, but yeah, now I'm gonna do some video editing even though I'm just really tired and not feeling well. Those nightmares really threw me for a loop. I can't, I can't even remember what some of them were now. <clears throat> I just remember they weren't about my ex, they weren't about Nan. But they were deeply traumatic. I think I'll just leave it there for today. Uh, the next few videos, while I'm not feeling the greatest, might be the might not be the greatest of these 101. They're gonna probably be a little bit more down and somber, just because this cough and chesty shit won't go away. And I think it might be because of my problem, because I haven't, I didn't stop smoking until Friday night. Because the depression was just got was so strong that I was like, no, I have to. I kind of was in a no-win situation, and now I'm going to be trying it, um, not smoking, and see if that improves my lungs. So yeah. I'll see you all tomorrow, guys.